Every day in Uganda, malaria kills 14 children aged below five years. After many years of trying unsuccessfully to eradicate malaria, scientists now have a new idea, more mosquitoes. This time, however, scientists at the Uganda Virus Research Institute say they plan to produce genetically modified mosquitoes which do not spread the disease. You hope that that modified trait can be spread through the natural <coughs> mosquito populations and as it spreads, the numbers reduce and as they reduce, then at some point you can break the malaria transmission cycle. The research is in its initial stages and will be carried out of a new facility opened on Monday at the Institute. Because the version that we want to use as a tool have to be able to spread that modification that we're talking about from the parents, the offsprings, in a relatively short amount of time or at an increased rate. The insectary that has been launched today is just a drop in the ocean of what is required to complete the research that may last for 10 years or more. The researchers say a lot is needed, including funding. And international guidelines require that for <coughs> genetic modification, you need a facility that can contain them to a certain degree of containment, and that's what we build. It is through science that we will be able to overcome poverty and transform Uganda into an upper middle class uh, income country. Uganda is among the 10 high burden countries for malaria and accounts for an estimated 4% and 3% of the global number of cases and deaths respectively. Some of the worst affected districts are in Acholi, Lango and West Nile regions. If the science works, these and other areas might find themselves with a lot more mosquitoes, but a lot less malaria. Walter Mwesije, NTV.